Researchers are sounding the alarm on damaging impacts of smoke from wildfires on air quality. Yeah, scientists say as vehicle emission levels decreased in 2020, wildfires became more frequent. And News 5's Renee Skinner has more for us on why this is so important to pay attention to the air quality alerts that we've been getting. Good morning, Renee. That's right, Bree. Ira, wildfire smoke includes harmful contaminants, including fine particulate matter, one of the deadliest air pollutants known to humans, and even one hour of smoke exposure can affect our lungs and hearts. Now, Colorado wildfire smoke leads to dangerous health consequences, including premature deaths, emergency room visits, COPD cases and other health issues. Toxic air pollutants in wildfire smoke can drift hundreds of miles downwind, according to the Natural Resources Defense Council. And wildfire smoke in the U.S. can be nearly 50 times larger than the area burned directly by the fires. It's fast becoming a problem, you know, all across the country because it does not stay in one place. It doesn't even respect, you know, international borders. Canada's fires affect us. We're all in this together in terms of addressing the challenge and our exposure risk. Now, wildfire smoke is also a major occupational health risk for firefighters and outdoor workers, such as farmhands, telephone line technicians, and construction workers. Now, the best thing you can do whenever you get that air quality alert or weather alert on your phone is to heed those warnings and limit your time outdoors. For more information on the story, we want you to visit our website, koaa.com. Always watching out for you, Southern Colorado, Renee Skinner, News 5.